I'm Doug Taylor. I'm Nan Wu. And this is the boat that Sea Wind Catamarans has uh, recently built for us, and we look forward to taking possession in the next several weeks. We've, we've spent uh, two or three years looking for the boat that will enable us to do the next chapter in our lives, um, sailing the South Pacific and whichever seas may follow. So Nan and I had some specific needs. We're both uh, very active scuba divers and we wanted to be able to dive from our boat and be able to refill tanks on board. So Sea Wind uh, worked with us very closely to mount a scuba compressor on board, upsize the generator capacity in order to drive that uh, compressor, and put it in a package that is truly functional and easy to operate. And that was just the first thing I was interested <laughs> in doing. Next, and this was truly important, I wanted to be as independent as possible from marinas and outside power, so total solar, solar capacity upgraded to 1120 watts on this particular sea wind, uh, divided between uh, three independently regulated solar generating units. Then because we were going to be cruising both um, in and around the U.S. and Mexico, as well as the South Pacific and Australia, right. we needed to have the option of dockside power being either 120 volt 60 hertz or 220 50 hertz power. Um, we are rigged to plug into either one and power our boat uh, dockside if we ever need to. Yeah. Correct. This was all factory installed, factory done, factory hung. Uh, all discussed at length um, with us during the build process and um, very special for us was visiting the boat at the factory as it was being built to meet the people doing it. Tell you what, mm. if you were to pick three to five favorite things of this boat, what would they be, my uh, dearest? It would be the salon, it has all the ventilation, the visibility and open up to the backside, you know, of the boat, the shower. Um, the toilet, electric, and the kitchen is very spacious, and a lot of storage. And also they built a special, kind of a specialized, uh, customized uh, closet for me. So you can hang all your dresses in a lot of closet space. My fav favorite things would be slightly different but overlapping. Um, the sea wind fold down door that allows the salon to go into the uh, cockpit space. I like that the sea wind does not have a lot of freeboard and windage, making it easy to maneuver in tight spaces for people like me that might not be a perfect boat handler 100% of the time. The sails and all the rigging are well laid out for a shorthanded crew. I can easily see either one of us sailing this boat independently if and when we had to. And as a couple, it'll be no problem. Number four was actually the modular construction of the large pieces bonded together mm -hmm. to make a very stout boat. It's an excellent design. Actually, the helm position, I love it being on a single level. I level right. with the salon, no the cabin. I do not need to, nor will Nan, need to ever step up or down into or out of a helm station. One less opportunity to trip, fall, stub your toe, or otherwise become injured in rough seas and uh, tough situations. Uh, that to me is wonderful. 360 degree view, particularly for me in tight quarters maneuvering, priceless. Absolutely. The glass surrounding the salon, yeah. tempered glass, not plastic, not plexiglass, not um, anything that's going to yellow, craze um, easily. It's perfect. Um, a flat targa top to get to the mainsail, easy. Okay, so needless to say, six. I could go on. I, I go I'm ahead. I'm going to do a number six. Okay, you do a number I, six. Because I cruise on this boat from Bahamas to Annapolis. 
So it's really like I was ta telling you that you can control the boat when you're on watch from inside when the weather is not good. So it's, it's really convenient and you don't have to be outside exposed to the element. You're totally protected. I, I couldn't be happier <laughs> and the boat is stout. Um, we'll be able to meet our needs. It has held up well historically for people that have been sailing these across and thousands fast. and, and fast. thousands of miles. Not just stout, and fast. Yeah, indeed quick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because otherwise it just, uh, it's a very slow cruise. Yeah, we, we did not want to sail on a barge and so... Or floating condo. <laughs> right, and we did not want a floating condominium. It's a excellent handling boat for a short-handed crew um, that will put up with the rigors of what we intend to put it through. <laughs>